<laughs> We've all felt it. That feeling that something is watching you while you're in bed. At your most intimate moments. When you are in the darkness of your bedroom, resting, thinking, talking, masturbating, or fucking. Especially when you're fucking. It's the feeling of eyes just watching you. The feeling that horrible things are all around you, right next to you, behind you. Yes. Many of you have felt it at least once. You imagine grotesque beings such as the Elephant Man and other horribly deformed grotesque humanoids behind you, on your flank, under the bed, while you are in the throes of passion with your partner, feeling that they are waiting for you to look in their direction so they can scream directly in your face and embrace you with disfigured arms and pull you closer to their horrifying bodies to lick your face and kiss your mouth. Or do so much worse. It's also that feeling you get as you enter your dark restroom at night. The feeling that when you turn on the light, you'll see the thing just naked and grotesque next to you. A writhing, horny, vengeful creature, hell-bent on taking you back to the depths with him. And his only aim is to be inside of you. Or, perhaps, you begin to feel something waiting for you behind the shower curtain. You check, and there's nothing. It's a powerful presence you sense around you. You're not crazy. There are horrible things that watch us at night, usually during our time of slumber. They don't always harm us, but it has happened. Usually, they just want to watch you while you fuck. Just be careful when you wake up in the middle of the night to use the bathroom. They usually leave by daylight, or when we wake up to start our day, but sometimes, just sometimes, you can see them. And if you do, I wish you good luck, because there's nothing you can do to stop them from enjoying you all for themselves. When you turn on that bathroom light tonight, remember this passage. Should you feel that feeling prior to turning on the lights, if you don't want to be a sex slave to one of these wretched freaks, before you turn on the light, pull out one of your hairs from the root and leave it on the counter as an offering to them. I mean... Unless, if that's your thing. 